Fears of a serial killer have people in Stockton, California nervous, especially as it gets dark. That is when the killer has struck. Police hope a surveillance image will help in their manhunt. Christine Sloan has the very latest on this search. A California city on edge as the urgent search continues for a possible serial killer or killers. At this time, we don't know if it's a person two or three, we just don't know. Five men shot dead in Stockton over the past three months, starting in July. Police have released a surveillance photo of a person of interest. Investigators say the killings meet the FBI's definition of a serial killer. 54-year-old Renzo Lopez was one of the victims. He was a musician who sang about violence on the streets of Stockton. This is a recent video. His heartbroken brother says Renzo was homeless but was trying to get his life back together. It's hard to process that this has happened, you know. I mean, me and my brother have been like twins since we were kids, you know. We're a year, year apart, so uh, we're pretty close. All of the victims are mostly Hispanic, men between the ages of 21 and 54. The murders in different locations, but taking place in dark areas late at night or early in the morning. And the victims were all ambushed, but investigators say the killings weren't gang-related or robberies. 35-year-old Paul Alexander Yaw believed to be the first person killed. In a statement, his family says he was a good boy who grew into a good man with a big heart, adding he was always there for you if you needed him. His mother telling ABC News she's sharing Yaw's photo in hopes it will solve the cases. Authorities are offering an $85,000 reward for information that will lead them to the killer or killers. Meantime, police are warning people in Stockton to be extra vigilant and to not walk alone. Christine Sloan, ABC News, New York.